spook easily. Find out what you can. We'll meet up at the rendezvous. This is a complete mess. Rash and Claire are offline. You need to solo this while I figure out what's going on. Shh. Listen. Shooting! Move! Cells man the tower guns. They're slower but still effective. You've seen what they can do, so keep out of the spotlight. Tango with the oak! Call it in! an escort for that intel. You don't have long to intercept. Not like it's important or anything, but finding out who tortured me would resolve several personal issues I have.
think I see something. Located Iron Horse. Brilliant. Look for the skinning lab file. Don't let him slip me.
radio check. Prophet, you there? Comms were down. EM pulse just knocked out the network. Rash is AWOL. I must make it my highest priority, but Michael has your brief. Records tell me there's a Seth mind carrier near your location. With your sensitivity to the alien influence, you might want to swing wide. Negative. The Seth have one collective intelligence, a hive mind, and it's all dependent on the Alpha. Now he's free, they're all waking up. These mind carriers are part of that process. I need to get eyes on. A hive mind? But you have a lot of alien material in your DNA. I don't know if any of this is a good idea. Rendezvous about 30 mics. Sign of rash. I'm getting. 
seen reports of Ceph activity all over the dome. Cell are being annihilated. Network is nearly back online, but our field commanders are reporting revived Ceph everywhere. The dome perimeter hasn't been breached, but inside... My god. They're exterminating everything human. I need to find Rash. I'm... I'm not trained for anything like this! Prophet, heads up. There's a disabled pinger close to your location. With all this Ceph activity, it might become operable again. You think you should steer clear? Maybe. But if it has a power source, I might be able to make use of it.
I've set up shop above the skinning lab. Enter under Tower 1 Bravo. We'll RV there. You don't have to go back in there, Michael. I can work the suit cradle remotely. I'll be fine. More worried about profit. side of the tower to the bridge. goes by where I don't wish I was you. Even with all that God knows what hardware, wetware, Seth mutation bullshit going on under that skin of yours, I take it. Come on. Just a moment. 
time before they put me into one of these things. Because that's what the Nana suit is, right? A Ceph exoskeleton. Now, there's no telling what he'll become. You can handle this, my boss. Do it. I'm accessing the memory retrieval systems. Filter it. There was always a risk. We triggered a fundamental change in your nature. are cleared. I'm registering critical neurological changes. You should be able to make a clear link with the Ceph now. What's this? Michael, you shouldn't. Don't. Why not? It won't help. Operation. The nanosuit is then fully removed. Subject 8A. Sergeant Michael C. 
sites is, uh, is still functioning at near optimal levels, but accelerated degradation is to be expected. You did this to me. Michael, please listen to me. You are the reason why. I, I mean, I fight Cell because of you. Because... Is that why you cared? Or were you pretending to care because of this? Because of your own fucking guilt? I didn't have a choice, Michael! The Cell program, we were in debt, you know how this works. I was forced to do this. To all of those people. I had to listen to their screams day after day after day. I know what I did. Jesus, believe me, I know. And I'll have to carry that with me as long as I live. Every day of my life. Michael! And feeling bad about it makes it all right, does it? If you're so fucking sorry, Claire, how come I had to find out like this? Why didn't you just come clean, you lying Michael, fuck? Michael, listen to me. You know how it works. You know she didn't have a choice. She did what she had to do. No choice. Just doing what she's told. Just following orders. Who the fuck does that sound like, Prophet? I'll tell you one thing, though. She was right about you. You might as well be a fucking machine because you sure as hell ain't no human being anymore. I mean, you never were much good at it to begin with, but Jesus Christ, look at you now! Whose face are you wearing under that helmet these days, Prophet? Do you even have a face anymore? We all had to make sacrifices. You had a choice, mate. Everyone has a choice. Look, I told you everything you needed to know. Remember these. All the men who died under your command because you were just following orders. Because you had no choice. Just like her. Psycho. No, mate. You take that suit of yours, and you go fight your own battles. Like always. Mike! Wait. No, Claire. He's right. Let him go. Oh, God. We just got intel on Red Star Rising. Listen carefully. Archangel is a key regulator platform in Cell's new wireless energy grid. But that's not all it does. The system's massive power store can be discharged via a broad area directed energy weapon, meaning assured destruction of hostile elements and metropolitan area depopulation events. Protocols exist for Archangel to be retasked for a number of alternate outcomes. When that outcome is the threat of Ceph Stage 3, Archangel begins the most aggressive protocol set available, Red Star Rising. Oh, God. They're gonna obliterate New York. Total orbital annihilation. Why can't cells stay out of my goddamn way? I need to get everyone out to the perimeter. You're wasting your time. I have to save as many lives as I can. No, it won't matter. It's not gonna be like Ling Shan. Archangel has a massive global energy store. They feed all that power back into the Alpha Seth. They'll punch one hell of a hole in the Earth. There'll be no Earth left. So what can we do? Connect to a Ceph mind carrier. If I can get inside their heads, maybe I can reverse the awakening, put them all back to sleep. If there's no Ceph threat, Cell will call off Archangel. You're going to link yourself to the Ceph? Prophet, you struggled to resist their influence even when your mind was protected. 
We've turned those safeties off now. That means the nanites in your suit are free. That means they can transform into anything, any form imaginable. You could actually become a Seth. That's a risk I'm willing to take. Get out of there, Prophet! 
backup ASAP. The situation is out of control. It didn't work, but the Seth Hive mind is pure energy. If I let them in a little more, I can take that power for myself. Prophet, come back to me and listen. I've got more details on Archangel. It's already in transfer orbit. It could be on us within the hour. We also know cells evacuated everywhere but a single facility about five clicks from here. It must be a command point for the satellite. Get me inside and we can shut Archangel down together. Are you with me on this, soldier? Yes, ma'am. In there. Five minutes, okay? Just five more minutes. Claire? Claire! God damn it!
I read you. Give me a sip. Prophet, thank God. We're taking heavy losses. Romeo 12 has set up a perimeter, but... Prophet, it's hopeless. There's no end to them. The Seth just keep coming.
We are clear and ready for takeoff. Over. Profit, evacuating Romeo 12 to a defensible position. Over. Copy that, Psycho. Hotel 5, get ready. 